hope not, because alcohol can lead you to say things and do things that you really wish you hadn't. Isn't this what you're supposed to say? Yeah. So if any of your buddies ever pressure you to take a drink, just tell them you promised your dad you would. I'd do anything to keep you safe. Okay. Well, I hope this is working. I promise. Well, you too, Dad. They really do hear you, Brian. Yeah. So start the conversation even before they're teenagers. Yeah. For tips on what to say, visit underagedrinking.samsa.gov. A message from the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration. January 16th at 10 on Discovery. Get them in the bush. We're no strangers to bears. Now, you bring a cow into this equation, this is going to test us in ways we've never been tested before. As Brown Town. Got a bear on the beach. Become Bear Town. They can smell the cow. It's very important to stand your ground when you're facing a bear. It's over there. If you do anything to instill that you're prey, it's going to attack. All new Alaskan bush people. Wednesday at 9 on Discovery, and catch up on Discovery Go. Farley and crew race Ian back to base camp after a freak accident injured his left arm. Okay, so we're going to be shallow here, Todd. Over the last three weeks of the expedition, hold on, hold on. Ian has been an invaluable member of the team. Nice drive. If he's forced to leave, it'll be another devastating blow to Farley's seemingly cursed operation. Okay, we're gonna hit. Hang on. Good. <laughs> Wait, uh, hang on, everybody. On the ride home, you know, I was honestly just hoping the Ian would be alright. Okay, coming in. Yeah. Hang on. Everybody, hang on. But you still have to get the cage out of the river and get it back on the boat. Obviously, it's gonna be a little heavier. It's gonna be a little more weight for everyone without Ian. We don't have an Ian, so we're going to have to use the winch. We won't try to lift it, we'll just spin it. <laughs> Do it together. Okay, now we're going to pick it up with the winch. You ready, Crap? Okay, now you get off. Okay. I think, Kelly, you're going to have to hold it. Because it's going to want to come onto the boat. The only thing going through my mind was how bad I'd let down the team. Somebody's got to be on shore pulling the bottom of it. Okay. I knew that they were going to have to pick up slack. And I'm the one that caused that slack. Hold on a second. Kind of caught here. Okay. I'm so sorry, guys. It's okay. We got it. Yeah, don't worry about it. The last thing that guy wants to do is to let the rest of us down. And he knew that if he truly did hurt himself, that he's not going to be here. All right. That's, that's good enough. He's going to have to go have that arm taken care of. Okay. I'm going to start backing up here. Here we go. We don't have any medical care on this island. I mean, if Ian wants to get treated, he's going to have to go fly back to Fort Moresby. Yeah. Now start your turn. It feels like to me the island is tearing our team apart. I think it was a uh, final warning. Like, you guys are going to come back upriver, then I'm going to take out your strongest player. Now, Todd, we do have some shallow snacks here. Right. Hug those snacks. Hang on. Okay. During the two-and-a-half-hour journey back to base camp, it becomes clear Ian needs immediate medical attention. He'll have to be flown to the nearest hospital, located 400 miles away in Port Moresby on the main island of Papua New Guinea. Ian, let me carry your bag. No, I got it. <laughs> sure, not going to let me take it. No, man. Just, let me get up to right. the, let me right. get up to the high. Okay. But, you know, I'm always preaching to everybody to be careful because we're this far out yeah. and this is what happened. I don't know what we're going to do, man. One arm, I can help. Yeah, I expect you to come back if you got one good arm. Okay. But I can't allow you to come back if you're going to hurt yourself more. That's all I care about. Okay, buddy? Yeah. All right. Thank you, brother. Yeah, let's get you out here, man. Get you in. It's not the thing that bothers me. I really feel like I let these people down. I feel like I let everybody down. I didn't come here to leave him to you. 
I sure as hell didn't come here to leave my team. We're putting the team in jeopardy. Today's technology can make identity theft easier. 